Hello, hello, fellow FPVers, DIYers, and everybody else. So I set you a challenge. I set you a speed record challenge with the 250 or under class mini quad. Uh, why 250? Uh, because kind of 250 settled down as a standard size for the mini quad. And the other thing on a bigger quad, on a bigger quads you can crank up the six inch props and all these flat CNC squads and then and then off you go. More or less not much of a challenge, but 250 or under class there's much much bigger challenge simply because you cannot fit you cannot fit you cannot fit six inch props properly and there's a uh, this has to be DIYing involved uh, simply because all those flat frame CNC they will not do for the speed right well they will do actually but at these speeds at this speeds um, aerodynamics comes to play so there's much 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 more challenge okay so um, mission is loaded you choose whether to accept it okay uh, so I started to build my quad and I will be playing with my open card so I will share my build have a look have a look down uh, have a look down the video at the uh, link to FPV labs there's a uh, there's more info there's a challenge there's all the pictures of my of my of my build and let's have a look at the quad what do I have here right so as aerodynamics comes to play, I decided to go the slim route instead of a instead of a tilting motor route. Uh, basically, because there's no way of telling at the full speed uh, how much of a tilt there will be. If you're gonna miss that tilt, there's not gonna be much of efficiency. And anyway, if there's gonna be a tilt, let's say 45 degrees, so the rear props will get the uh, will get the dirty prop wash, which is not gonna be which is not gonna be efficient. Um, okay, motors a sunny sky 2207, uh, 2207, 2100 kVs. I will be testing on four cell, and then of course it has to go it has to go six cell for for more for more pitch speed. Uh, there's a canopy all aerodynamic. I'll take that off. I molded. I molded this one on my vacuum molding the the clear canopy glass. There's a few wrinkles. I just can't get my can't get my vacuum box working properly. It doesn't matter. It'll do. It'll do. Right. So ESCs. The first one ESCs that I've tried is the Sunrise 30 Amp on BL Heli on BL Heli software. I burn one of the motors and along with the basically just ESC brought down the motor as well on Simon K software on 6L. I couldn't get it. I couldn't get it working full throttle on a. It was only it was only up to a bit rough roughly 70 70 percent throttle. So I got this new I got these new ESCs. These are the custom built ESCs. Uh, have a look on my channel the video before this one i have a test of these escs they are they are working they are working spot on on 6l they rated a 20 amps but i was pulling i was pulling 26 amps at max um, i'll tell you about more about the props as long as i have it four cell set up uh for the moment i have the four cell well while i had these escs while i was waiting on these so as long as i have i'll give it a go i'll give it a go at a four cell so Basically, with a five-inch bullnose, five-inch bullnose propped, uh, I'm getting roughly a kilo, a kilo of thrust per motor on four cell. These are the five-inch bullnose props, but made from seven-inch instead of uh, made from six-inch like these ones, which they are getting the same, the same one kilo thrust, but, but. The pitch is visibly bigger from the bullnose made from 7 inch and when you're cranking up the speed your pitch speed is what you're looking for when you're aiming for speed so uh, hopefully the motors will spool up up to the very max and a bit more than than the 5 inch from 5 inch bullnose from 6 inches so we'll see that I'll give it a go I'll give it a go with both on 4 cell okay here's my immersion and C 600 milli milliwatts um, Video transmitter uh, hooked up a mini PZ 5 volt cam, uh, basically Afro Mini and uh, Frisky DR42 RX is powered from the immersion C 5 volt output. The power is the camera as well, basically. 
it, it gives around 300 milliwatts output on 5 volts so to power a cam an afro mini and a rex is just just about it like if if somebody will want to power a mobius or something that that will not work that will not work right so I got a lot of help. I got a help uh, from a friend with these ESCs that I'm testing for him. Another friend helped me, helped me with the 3D printed caps, aerodynamic for the for the quad. Uh, then another friend helped me with the softwares on the Sunrise ESC. So uh, another reason I decided to invert. I decided to invert the motors. There's a there's an argument going on which way is more efficient going this way and getting the dirty here in here or getting the dirty here bef before the prop and then getting the clean out so uh, i believe i believe this way i believe this way is more is more efficient on the other hand on the other hand on the six cells when i was trying this is the four inch four inch bullnose prop made from uh five by four and a half when i was trying uh basically if i will be going if i will be going the traditional way there's something like a quarter 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 of a disc quarter of a disc it's obstruction from the motor quarter of a disc blade and i know this bloody all the center center disc it's not uh it's it's not as much as important as the rest of a blade disc but still still like Every little, every little helps. Uh, the carbon booms I use 10 mil carbon booms. There's only single plate, and this thing will not withstand the crash. It was not built to. It was not built to bloody withstand the crashes and bashing. Uh, the frame itself it was built only for the record. The for its lightweight, it's only it's only something like 60 grams. 60 grams for a frame. So let me show you the weight. Okay, so with the four cell setup, I have 630 grams, all a flying weight, and I lift it up in here. This is bloody raw power. 630 grams. Basically, when I will be, I'll have a go. I'll have a go, as I said, on a four cell, and then I'll be like this one. This one was built basically for for six cell, three by. Uh, two by two by three cell basically these two batteries are 20 grams lighter than the one big uh, 2.2 rhino four cell battery that's uh, 40 c so basically on a six cell i'm gonna have uh, 610 grams of all up flying weight and here's a here's the best bit here's the best bit of it um with a five inch bullnose props made from Ooh, four sorry four inch bullnose props made from uh, five by four and a half I'm getting something around a kilo truss but the rpms is just screaming and the best bit on a six cell I have here HQ 5.4 props that gave me 1.4 kilos of truss per one motor so having my quad at uh, 600 grams all a flying weight and having 1.4 kilos but one more, uh, I have nine to one uh, trust to weight ratio. No, that's a that's a bloody so insane that I'm not sure will I be able to control it. As my as my other little as my other little minis that I fly only only three cell and I'm getting well managing to squeeze something like six to one or five to one trust to weight ratio on these on these batteries. So we'll see how mad that one will be. Uh, for the six cell setup, I'll be using 1.4 uh, nanotex. Uh, it says what was the 4080 discharge rate, but I don't see them lasting long. I might I might lift it up in the air and I will have one or two passes and then that's it. Probably just one pass because on the test stand on the test stand on six cell uh, these motors they were draining the battery in no time. Okay, so that's my little thingy. Let's go get it up in the air in the back garden to jump around. Uh, I'll tune it once I'll tune it uh, once I'll tune it. Then I'll then I'll then I'll stick on a then I'll stick on a canopy and then 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 we can have a go. Right, so uh, let's get it up. What do we have here? Level on, armed. Give it a go.
I can sense the braking. Whoa! She's aggressive. I'm kind of afraid even to give it a full punch. <laughs> Alright, so let's charge the batteries and she's good to go for a maiden. Test it out on the four cell, whatever can crank up the speed.